All right, we're here with episode 99 and 100 of My Hero. This one's called Our Brawl, and the next one's called The New Power and All for One. So we're getting into it. I'm excited, but we've hit 100 episodes of My Hero Academia. This was, no joke to you guys, the first video, the first show, the first anime I ever reacted to on the channel. My Hero at the end of season two, the stain arc. And how it's been through season three, season four, and season five. I've been through two different YouTube channels, a hundred or pff, at least like eighty episodes. So I think that was like uh, something. All I'm saying is this was a crazy journey. I appreciate you guys being along it with me. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with episode ninety-nine or season five, episode eleven, I believe, of My Hero Academia. This one's called Our Brawl. Last episode, we ended off with the discovery that Deku's eventually going to get six other quirks, and one of them includes Black Whip, who was one of the previous One for All uh, users' quirks, and the fact that it's able to emerge due to the enhancements and power gained by One for All in the recent years and the previous users is crazy. And Deku's going to need to be able, Deku's going to need to be calculated Think about exactly what he wants to do, and he cannot get too emotional. Those are the big things. I'm excited to find out what happens. I say we jump into it. Don't forget, if you guys want early access or full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead on Patreon. Links are in the description down below, like always, for you guys. If you guys want to support me and Patreon's not really your thing, if you guys could just leave me a like and a nice comment, it really does help me with that YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much appreciated, y'all. Let's hop into this, My Hero Academia, Season 5, Episodes 11 and 12. This is called Our Brawl, and the next one's called The New Power, and All for One. Let's do this. All right, here we go. I'm getting right back where we left off. He's like, we should continue it. Let it go for now. It definitely isn't just those two. Everyone is definitely still motivated, but I love how certain teachers have their certain biases for their students. Like, I think Eraserhead's honestly a Shinso. Like, he respects Shinso a lot. You're nicer than you look. He is a nice-ass teacher. I love Aizawa. But All Might for um, Deku, you know, a lot of teachers have their little favorites. Ooh, Mineta with the clutch. Let's go, Mineta with the Grape Shield. That's actually smart as shit. You can use that to get anywhere. Increase mobility, personal trampoline. Hell yeah. All part of the plan. Ooh, a little acid throw. <laughs> Hell yeah. One almost coming in though. What's he gonna do? And every masterpiece. Wow. <laughs> hey, he's not wrong. There are a lot of supporting characters who can outshine. <gasps> he, I didn't even know he touched Deku. That's my biggest concern. That's my biggest concern. Smooth. I'm telling you, Gunhead might have been the best internship of all the internships besides like Gran Torino. She has used that martial arts so many times. And it was a blank. He couldn't even use it. They were quick with it. She had him all. <laughs> Stay on his ass. Stay on his ass. Clutch. I could see that. I could see that a lot. Just his presence, his vibe, his exuberance. You know, like he's just... That type of personality, and we're using Black Whip. Oh my god, we're controlling <laughs> Master using all of us. Oh, Shinso likes cats? I didn't know that. I like Shinso a lot more now. I love cats. That is so dope. It is. He said that. These, are, these powers are on your side. I know, right? For us, it's been like over half an hour because we've seen everything that's been going on but for them it's literally been a few minutes and this man's mastered a new quirk what the hell oh definitely has some sort of limits 
Uh, Bakugo, I'm being observant as always. Oh, you need to be even more developed to be able to handle that. Damn it. We have way more to look forward to, though. So we got to fully use this, and then we'll be able to branch out into our sub-tech trees. It's like we're in a video game, man. All right, solid eight. So we use it against Bakugo. I love how he's we swiping like we're Spider-Man. Literally so mobile. He used to be only, he used to be able to only do one. He can do three quirks for ten minutes now. Like what? The only other quirk I can think of is Brainwash, Twin Size, Poltergeist, Twin Shot, Poltergeist, and Size. He wants you to have faith in him. And she immediately turned. Good. I wish Luke had more faith in Han and Leia when this was happening on Vespin. Oh my god, I love the 3D models, especially in this pipe-filled city-type arena. Just such good for mobility. And this man... This man is dashing! He used Twin Shot. Twin Impact. I'm just so used to playing TFT where it's called Twin Shot. He actually did. Low key. Monoma's really good at creating openings. Oh, he is not out yet. He was not going to give up that quick. Do not forget where you came from. Oh my god. Them gunhead more. Oh, Holder stuck against the wall with Mineta. And fucking Ashido comes in with the acid twist spin punch. Okay. Oh my god, he wrapped himself. Okay, Rock Lee. We're going for a Leafs barrage? Chill out. That's the issue. Even though you feel like you're moving forward at a great rate, these guys are all moving forward too. Go beyond plus ultra type beat. Come on. I love this little highlight montage of the matches so far. Everyone's been excelling. Everyone's been going crazy. UA is fire. We might have won, but still. They should be commended the whole time for their efforts, you know? <laughs> Midnight is committed to fair comment commentary. <laughs> Class A. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. I'm, I'm not shocked, though. Come Oh, yeah. But I feel like, to a small degree, you guys are going to be like, Monoma, take this in as, as what's-his-name said, carve it into your hearts, and take this loss and be better heroes. I don't feel like he'll make the transfer yet, but I feel like from where he was in Season 2 till now, oh my god, exponential growth. Oh yeah, Ochako, no hesitation, instantly was able to put herself on the line for her friend. I agree, I agree. <laughs> Very much so. She's been a part of some of the most critical fights and biggest activities in this show, you know? Yeah, literally one in a million. Wow. Are we is, did he so he passed? So is he transferring? He does have a long way to go, but that's why I'm here. I'm here to watch it. Welcome to the club, buddy. We've known how amazing they are for a minute. I could totally see Shinzo becoming the next generation eraser head, and he would be dope at it. Go with a plus ultra mentality. They need to do some sort of hand signal in the show, you know? Like, we got we got that attack on Titan. We got that Black Clover. I need something. Like, I don't know. All right, on to episode 100. Yeah, no, I'm telling you. In terms of the binding cloth, him being mobile, him using that to pull stuff down. Like, he is excelling a lot. Oh, 
Okay. So we don't know what class he's gonna be in, but Shinsa was most likely gonna be passing. So it really was a blank. And it didn't work for him. Hmm. Yeah, that's a fair thing to panic about. He can copy Eri, and then what? Is he gonna have more skill at turning back than she does because she's so young? It's been a minute since we've seen Eri and Mirio, the goats! Yeah, who are you writing letters to? Aww, that's cute. Aww. Seeing her smile is just such a nice thing, especially after last season. Oh my god. Look at them getting some some training in. Yeah, he went like crazy right there when he did it. The presence is gone. He could feel it earlier. We're having another conversation in the teacher's lounge. We always have the best conversations in here. <laughs> and now Bakugo's involved with it. That's hilarious. Bakugo is not lying. I don't know, but it's like. So that's why they're doing the secret training lessons. Makes sense. And it makes sense why it's just Bakugo and Deku trying to do this. <laughs> they are so similar but so different and strong in their own ways it's actually really unique when they put it like that you know he's better at withstanding heat but he's not as hard as kirishima mingle and talk about the training look at the <laughs> look at minata getting fucking tortured <laughs> Who knew? We're twerk, we're uh, quirk buddies. Technically, they've been merged together, so it is one quirk, but it is a derivation of the quirk. So I get what he's saying. It's all good, Todoroki. It was pretty crazy. <laughs> Sharp and dull. You, know, you guys are both just now getting the hang of everything, you know? Getting a lot deeper. I'm going to aim even higher as we cut over to Endeavor. <laughs> yeah, he's so geeked that his son hit him up. That told Roki texted him first. He's like, let's go! Wow, we're doing it. Oh, yes, he does. Shirakumo? Shirakumo. You know I'm writing that name now. You know my hero is so good at planting those seeds that aren't going to be watered and developed till four seasons later. So, hell yeah. Oh, we're here. He grows the horn and everything. Oh, my lord. It's a blank, just like Deku's. I copied the nature of the quirk itself. Oh. That's a good point. So let's say I have a quirk where I absorb, uh, like the guy from X-Men First Class, uh, Kevin Bacon, his his mutant powers he can absorb energy and dispel it at will so if mona let's say he absorbs a nuke mona touches him and he expends the nuke mona was not also going to have a nuke he's just going to have the ability to absorb nukes so that makes sense the, the essence of the quirk itself i get blanks once and i love how he calls them blanks yeah mona would be dead right now if his quirk was slightly different 
Which was, and without a racer head, that could have ended the world. We don't know. Someone who has a little more, yeah, a little more quirk knowledge. But it's not that easy. It never is. We're trying to save everyone because of you, Aerie. You actually give us so much hope. Like, I think it's about how you use it, exactly. Power in and of itself can be horrible, or it can be amazing, you know? He's talking about knives, so it's a little simpler for a little girl, but like, you, you can't just think of the negatives, you know? Think about all the good that you can do with your power. That is a good analogy to make. The power will become my ally, even though that power originally came from one of the darkest, most evil men in this world. It's only saving and doing good right now, you know? So it's like... I'm gonna master it for sure. Hey, I respect it. I respect it. Oh, it's snowing. I saw the next episode uh, had Christmas in the title. I, it was just snowing a couple of weeks over here too. I feel like I love snow days. The last day of their supplemental classes. If they pass the test today, everyone will be caught up. I'm down. A night... I was going to say, a snow-covered city night is one of the prettiest things you can see, but what is... These guys could flood this whole city. There's thieves. The fish are biting like crazy. That is the corniest villain I've ever seen. <laughs> That's Bakugo and All Might talking. Oh, this is for the movie, isn't it? That's his hero license. This is for the movie, isn't it? I need to watch the movie. You've only had them for 30 minutes. They're on their way home from their provisional license. This isn't for the movie. This is for the show. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. We get to see them be heroes. And they can do this in public now with their licenses. They don't have to worry about anything. <laughs> Carbonation? More determined to run. Bakugo is faster than all of you combined. I love his scarf too. Water, especially that fine and precise, can cut you in half. It's too strong for him, it's pushing him back. It's like when a fireman's hose goes crazy. This is the issue with civilians. Okay, non-hero All Might coming to save the day. Do what you can do. Good job, Bakugo. <laughs> let's heat this. Let's heat this. Let's heat this guy up. Flash freeze heat wave. Turn all that water to steam. <laughs> Who is this Buzz Lightyear <laughs> scooting on by? They are able to get it all bagged up. Nice. <laughs> He's like, you made my job so much easier. You guys did excellent. Just leave the rest to me. Slide and go. <laughs> Slide and go. Oh, if you guys heard that, someone followed my Twitch. It does feel good after they finally get their professional license. Yeah, we get a little test run for them. Let's go home. That was a good, that was a fun episode. It looks like we have an after credit scene on this episode as well. Oh, everyone's gonna have a surprise party for them, huh? Yeah. Woo, congrats. That's nice. <laughs> He's eating the cake. Well, talk about building us into this next arc. We're done with the class fights. And now I don't know where we're going, but I'm happy. So like I said, I don't know how, I do know eventually we're gonna get into the My Villain Academy arc. I don't know what that means or what that is gonna entail, but I do know that that is eventually going to happen. I loved the way that we had everything wrap up. We're finishing the Class A versus Class B training arc. We gotten a good amount of training and we've seen some results of how we've trained in the past as well especially like monoma i just knew monoma is one quirk at a time five minutes now we can do potentially four for ten 
as he's only do one at a time, but hold for, that's crazy. And I love how in depth his quirk goes, whether, you know, whereas to like, he had the whole description of blanks and how it just copies the essence of the quirk and not the details or the after effects of the quirk itself. It's, it's very, it's very cool. The details they go into for the quirks and the powers in the show, but all in all, like I said, I'm so glad we wrapped up this last arc. It was fantastic. I love seeing class B and the results of the training. I loved the cool ass fights, the great animation, great music, great hero moments, all that only for Deku to not be able to use Black Whip anymore because it seems as if like we got a little taste of it, but we're going to be able to do that and much, much more. That's an important part later on. Once we master one for all, all for one, I should say, I always get those two mixed up, but no one for all. Yes. One for all I get. Yeah. You guys know what I'm trying to say, but so we have a singular thing to master one for all. We're going to work on that while we do that. Then we'll be able to expand off and get our little sub tech tree. And it's super exciting. Um, great seeing Eri and Mirio again. Great having uh, Bakugo and Todoroki have their provisional licenses and then not even 30 minutes later get a chance to use them. Great work. Great fighting from them. The next episode is called Have a Merry Christmas. I'm assuming it's going to be a fun Christmas adventure with the with the class and I'm literally all here for it. I'm excited. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Don't forget to check out that Patreon, early access, full length, all that jazz. Don't forget to drink some water. Be safe out there. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace.